Hi everybody, it's Kathy here and I'm back with another Dollar Tree haul. Um, this haul is from the Clifton Park store, so if any of you are liking anything that I show you, uh, that's where I got it from. Okay, so uh, let me get started because I had quite a bit of stuff here this time and I want to get through this pretty quick. First thing I found was these balls, these decorative balls. They came in silver and they came in gold. And let me tell you, I had to spray these before I showed them to you because the fallout on them is incredible. I picked up two of the gold and three of the silver and I'm gonna put those in a bowl or a vase or something and I just th thought they were beautiful. Ooh. And I still got glitter all over me. Next thing I found was I found the uh, brush lettering markers. There's uh, a point on each end. There's a extra fine tip and a brush tip. And I picked it up in the yellow. Picked it up in the blue. In the green. The red. And the purple. There were a bunch more other colors, but I thought those colors would be ones that I might use more often than the others. So I picked up those colors. Hold on a second, guys. I just knocked something off the table. <clears throat> and I might as well show that to you now. Found some Christmas socks. These are the little no-show socks, and these have a snowman on them, and they're striped. Every time I got to get the socks. And I'm trying to get a different pair of Christmas socks for every day of December. Got this one with the reindeer on it and the gray polka dots. Got this one with the Christmas tree on it. And the little pink toe and pink heel. And then this one is a crew sock with Santa Claus. And it's got the striped foot with the red heel. So I think I got about 10 pair now and uh, I'm working on getting a different pair for every day of December. Also picked some up for Caroline. Got her the little tree so she can match with Grandma. Got her the, the fuzzy Santa Claus. The beard here is like a fuzzy material. I also got these in my size. And I got the Santa that says ho 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 on it. And these are size one to seven. I hope they'll fit her. They might be a little big, but she's got pretty big feet for a kid her size. Picked up two things of ribbon. Picked up this plaid. This is the um, wire edged ribbon. It's nine feet. And I picked up the plaid. And I picked up this with the uh, poinsettias on it. This is also the wire ribbon with the nine feet of ribbon. I picked that up because I saw Thrifty Tiffany make this really pretty gift with a cooking book and that that plaid ribbon tied around it as a bow and then she put a, a soup ladle in it because it was a, a book about soups. And I thought, what a great idea that is. So maybe I can do something along those lines. And um, yeah, that's why I picked those up. Picked up this little statue my brother is into this kind of stuff, all this funky, you know, kind of things. So he lives in Orlando. I'm going to ship this down to him for Christmas. I picked up the elephant for my friend Connie. She's collecting elephants. Her mom used to collect elephants and now she's doing it. So I picked this up for her. Picked up three packs of party invitations for my Christmas party. They're not very Christmassy, but I bought some Christmas stickers and I thought maybe I could just put a Santa sticker on them. I couldn't find any Christmas invita party invitations, so I got these to send out to my friends. There are eight invitations in a pack and they're by Expressions from Hallmark originally. $3.89. Got them for a dollar. Picked up these little stands. 
I got two in this shape, which is a squared bottom. And uh, what I saw, um, Pretty and Flawed do, and I picked up this round one, is she was going to glue these together to make a, a bigger stand and then have the smaller stand. I thought that was a super great idea. And these were the only three that they had. So I scooped those right up. Let me see how big they are. They are about three and three quarters inches. So when you put the two together, you know, it's going to be taller, be about, you know, seven and a half inches. And then the little lower one, I thought those were really pretty. And I'm really into silver lately. Not lately. I always like silver, but they had it in silver and they had it in gold. Picked up uh, another one of these little memo books because this little kitty is so stinking cute. He's so cute. And it comes with a little pen. And I probably will keep that for myself. It's really cute. I found these owl stickers. They're um, the, this, what do you call them? Pop-up stickers. I love my owls. And there's 10 of them in the pack. And they're so cute. I love this big, big tree with the owls on it. That's really pretty. So I got those. Uh, in the, in with those other pens, I found these artist paintbrushes. They have the like fine point tip to them. Got those for my crafting. It says there's six of them in here. Picked those up. Picked up this set of five paintbrushes for my friend Connie. She was looking, she bought um, some paint with water books for her granddaughters and she was looking for the multi-pack of brushes so I picked this up for her speaking of which I did find those paint with water hold on trying not to knock everything over here found these paint with water books they're so cute there's this one and you just use water to paint the pictures instead of paint well, Let's see some pictures, how about? All right, there we go. See, aren't they so cute? I picked up this one. And I picked up this one. It's got the little pictures in it, so cute. Apparently there's a set of four and I have three of them. And this one with the kitty cat on it. So I'm gonna give those to my grandkids probably. Madeline and Caroline picked up this little doorknob hanger. I thought it was so pretty. Let's see. It's got the red and silver bo uh, bells on it. It's got the um, gold in the ribbon here, and then it's red and white on the top. But I thought that was pretty. So I picked that up. And it's got the little holly berry in the middle. This I've been searching for for the longest time. I saw somebody haul it quite a while ago. And when I went into the Clifton Park store uh, yesterday, wow, the place was immaculate. Everything was neat and clear in the, in the sticker aisle and in the book aisle. And I finally found the internet password papers. It's for a journal. I don't journal. Um, but I like it. It's got the little holes in it and I can put this in a little folder, not a folder, but a binder. And, uh, I was looking for this forever. It's got 50 sheets cause I just have a list typed out with my, um, you know, passwords, usernames and passwords. I have so many of them. So I'm really happy I found that. And it's pretty, look at the pretty flowers on the top was really excited to cross that off my wish list. Uh, I found the holiday flavored dum-dums. Pick those up. There are doo -doo -doo, over 20 pops. The flavors are hot chocolate, sugar cookie, sugar plum, apple cider, Merry Christmas, Polar Punch, gingerbread, and green apple Grinch. 
And everybody likes a little dum-dum once in a while. So I picked those up. Found another of the unicorn squishies. I had gotten one for Madeline and one for um, Caroline, so I picked one up for Sarah. I picked up this cute little tiger one for me. He's just so cute. I have these things lined up on my dresser in my bedroom. So I put this put this one next to the sloth and the kitty cat and the pineapple. But he's so cute. Look at him. Had to have him. <sighs> Picked up some notebooks. I was looking for these because I think they're really pretty. Um, I got a G for my sister Jenny for Christmas. So I hope you're not watching and you're going to know what you're getting for Christmas. Got that for her. Picked up the K for me, of course. And these are by Crown Jewels. And it does not say how many pages are in them. But they're lined and they have like those three little dots on the top. Picked up another K for my stepdaughter Christy. I found the crossword pocket puzzle book. I love the design on the front of this, but it's got crosswords, all different kinds of crosswords, and it's got the little elastic on it so you can carry this in your purse when you're waiting in the doctor's office or in the airport or anywhere. You can just pull this out and work on it. I got picked up two of those. I was really excited to find those because I saw people hauling them and I haven't been able to find them, but I did spot them yesterday. And I got the word search one, which just has, you know, word search in it. And I thought this was really pretty. Really, really pretty. I think they had Sudoku, Sudoku too, but I don't do that. I don't understand it or whatever, but it's not my thing. I like word search and I like crossword puzzles. So I picked those up. Uh, I picked up three more packages of the paper foot masks, the coconut. I'm going to give these as gifts. And I got, <clears throat> excuse me, two more of the foot scrubs to put with the foot masks. And I picked, I, only, I don't know why I only picked up one of these, but I picked up this little brush. It's a petty tool, it's four-sided. It's got a nail brush, a pumice stone, a metal nail file, and a smooth nail file. So I picked that up to go along with the foot masks and the uh, foot scrub. And this is by My Beauty Spot. Came in pink and blue. I should have got two of them, I don't know why I didn't. But they're out there, so I'll probably just grab one when I see it. Picked up these two sets of paint. For the kids. This one's Mickey Mouse and all the colors are shaped in Mickey Mouse's ears. And this one is um, princesses and it's all different shapes of hearts. I thought they, those were cute for the kids and they close up so you know I like them. They'll like them. Uh, and the last, oh no, I got, I picked up two more of these Elf baskets. They look like the elves. I love these. So I got these. You know, I'm going to probably use one of these and put the foot mask in and the thing and the other thing and just make a little gift basket out of it. So that's the plan anyway. It's going to look better than that, but got two of them. And then for the kids, I found these big Santa Claus belt buckets. I got these for the little kids. I picked up three of them. They're pretty good size. And I uh, can use that to put their gifts in. But I thought they were really pretty. And they're well made. I like them a lot. So I got three of those. <clears throat> Here we go with the Christmas boxes. Picked up this one that says Merry and Bright, and these are super cute. They open up like this. 
great for a, a gift card or a piece of jewelry or you know something small and the box is adorable I also found it in the um, penguin again it opens like this super cute there were a bunch of these um, that they had a Santa Claus one too but they were all missing the thing on the outside so I don't know what happened with the when they were putting them on the shelves but those were the only two that were decent looking picked up this box with a little um, log cabin on it. it says Merry Christmas and it's got the log cabin here Merry Christmas it's got the little sleigh next to the cabin and the cabin is raised like three-dimensional and I thought that was really super pretty so I got that I finally found these boxes with the clear sides this one says Merry Christmas all around it and it looks like this on the top and I just thought it was really cute they had one other design but I, I just really picked up that one because I thought it was cute then I found this one it says Santa's workshop and it's got Santa and his sleigh and then it's got the reindeer Got the little elf and the snowman outside Santa's workshop. And then it's got the elves dancing in the window and the one on the outside. And the top is all sparkly, glittery, and it just opens up like that. I thought it was really cute. You could use it, you know, I don't even have to use it as a box or gift box. I think I might just use it for decor. I thought that was really pretty. And then I've got this giant box, which I thought was super cute. It's got all the letters just to Santa on it. And it's very tall. It's, let me see, where'd my ruler go? Hang on, it's here somewhere. There it is. It's over, it's over a foot tall. It's gotta be 13 and a half inches, big box blue on the top and blue on the inside put a nice big bottle of liquor in there make somebody happy and that nope I got something else my last thing I got was this bag I thought it was super pretty it's got a foam snowflake on the outside see how that lays on there so pretty and then it's just you know the snowflake on the back and then the sides are gold striped they also had this in silver but I thought the gold was really pretty I think it might have come in blue as well but I thought the gold was really pretty and it's got the little tag it says happy holidays on it and the dots are all sparkly glittery and I believe you guys that's everything I got um, like I said, these balls are beautiful, but the glitter fallout on them is unbelievable. I had to spray them down before I started this haul because it was just everywhere. But they are gorgeous. They're really, really pretty. I may give these to my sister for Christmas because this is her kind of thing. But I really like them, so I don't know. Maybe I won't. Anyway, I hope you all have a great weekend. Um, we got six inches of snow last night here in New York, which I am not ready for on November 15th. Sorry, not ready for it. I like it. It's fun to look at out the window, but you got to shovel it. And that's not fun. Anyway, hopefully if it stays around long enough, Caroline and I will go out and play in the snow tomorrow. And uh, I will see you all in my next haul. Make sure you like and subscribe. Have a nice night, guys. Bye-bye.